Okay, we are videoing now. We have Laser Lemon. How are you, Laser Lemon? You can talk. Oh, me? Good. You okay? Yeah. Um, I'm looking at your right ear and a little spot toward the top of the ear that's yellow. How long has it been yellow and infected like that? For about two, three days. Has it ever happened to you before? Yes. It has. And then behind the ear is red and irritated, right? Yes. Okay. So I want to show everybody your other ear. So we're going to stop for a moment and then we're going to have you turn over real quick, okay? Okay. Okay, so we're rolling again and we're getting real close. If you can see, Gubby Jean, if you move her hair out of the way right there, there. You can see she has a very similar structure on the left ear. This one has swollen up and drained before too, hasn't it? Yes. Laser Lemon, you have a special condition. You have a little redundancy in the structures of your ears. You have what's called a branchial otic malformation. Have you ever heard of that before? Um, I Googled it. You did? Mm -hmm. Okay, so you knew that you've had, you, that you have these. I knew that I had these. I just didn't know they were so rare. They are very rare. And have you ever seen an ear, nose, and throat surgeon about maybe getting this investigated to see if anything needs to be done for these? No. Okay. Um, my family has them, so I thought uh, it was normal. So they run in the family. Okay. Yes. So the other one, what we're going to do is we're going to drain for you, but there's no cyst or sac that needs to be removed. Uh, what needs to happen is we just need to put you on antibiotics and get you well, okay? Okay. All right, so we're going to stop for a moment and let you turn back over. Okay. Okay, we're back on the other side with Laser Lemon. And, um, wow, did I say, was it Laser Lemon? Mm -hmm. Is that right? Okay, so I'm going to put this right here. Now, you said your sister had surgery to correct hers, right? Yes. Okay, so both of them. So it runs in the family. So you have a really interesting uh, genetic kind of issue in your family. It's not very common, and I bet there's a lot of doctors out there that have never seen these before. Um, there's really nothing we can do to make this less painful, so we'll just kind of do it, okay, and be done real quick, as it would hurt just as much to put an injection in this as it is to do this. Deep breath, and okay, so there you go. So this material tends to build up. And when it does, did that hurt very much? Yeah. So you feel that right there. Take a deep breath, and we'll just do a gentle kind of squeeze. There's not a lot in there, okay? It's just very little. And guess what? We got it. It's all out now. Mm -hmm. So I want people to know that are out there right now saying, well, that's going to come back because he didn't get the cyst. There is not a cyst. This is actually a birth defect of sorts. And we need to send her over to ear, nose, and throat to have this further evaluated to see if she does need to have anything done. I don't think she's going to because it's not that severe. And what's going to happen is just sometimes she's going to have this get infected. But we'll find out for sure. That sort of falls into the realm of what an ear, nose, and throat surgeon might do. Gumby Jean, thank you for videoing. No problem. Hey. Laser Lemon, thanks for sharing your video on YouTube with all our friends. It's okay with you, right? Yes, no, thank you. No, you're welcome. Thank you. And we're going to get you some antibiotics here in just a moment. See this little red down here? Yeah. All of this is related to this issue. Branchial, branchial otic malformation. Very interesting case today. All right, thanks for sharing. All right, guys, bye. <laughs> okay. okay, tell us about Meta 7. It gives me great energy. When I take it, I was shocked. I take it and I have energy the whole entire day, I'm like running a marathon half the time. Really? You yeah. feel good? I mean, don't it's you? like way better because I was super fatigued before. Okay, and so tell us is it is it natural feeling energy or is it jittery no, shaking? No, it's totally it's natural. It's not jittery at all. And focus? Yeah, sure. Focus is better as well. Yeah, yeah it's amazing. Notice that, yeah. yeah. Okay, well, thanks.